No! No way! No! Well, well, well. It's another one of these days, guys. We got mail! Let's go! <laughs> Alright guys, so you already know what's about to happen in this video today. You guys love seeing keyboard and mouse videos on my channel, so you know what? We're bringing them back, alright? Pretty sure I do one of these kinds of videos like once a week or so on my channel, and you know, if you guys keep loving them, then maybe drop a like if you want to see more, because that would be cool. But anyways, today we are going to be doing the $1 keyboard versus $100 keyboard challenge, or not challenge, I guess just video, and I'm going to tell you guys what I honestly think about both keyboards separately, all right? So, um, yeah, let's just open up this, uh, package, see what we can find inside. I actually don't remember what's in here. I, it's been a long time since I ordered. All right, here we go, boys. The moment of truth. And, yup, I might have just cut the keyboard in half. Da-da-da-da! Here it is. <laughs> wow, this keyboard is a piece of trash. That's pretty dope. All right, so... This keyboard actually cost me 19 cents on Amazon. And uh, it's called the iHome Computer. It's just like a standard classic keyboard. Um, you know, I don't know. A lot of people are under the impression that you need like a fancy keyboard in order to play Fortnite and you need like a crazy light up nerdy keyboard. But you know, that might not be the case. All right, and we're gonna test that out today because I know a lot of like fancy gaming keyboards have like mechanical buttons on them and it kind of helps you out with like, just knowing like your placements on the buttons and pressing them down easier and all that stuff and it sounds kind of cool to be honest but you know what maybe you don't even need any of that maybe a one dollar keyboard is going to be sufficient enough and we're going to try this out guys so the cat's out of the bag boys this is what the keyboard looks like pretty standard keyboard okay if i'm being real here with you guys honestly it feels kind of good for some reason it actually feels a lot better than my actual keyboard that i use which is a logitech G410, okay, and uh, you know, I'm not sponsored or anything. This is just like my preferred keyboard, I guess. I've been using it for a long time. Never really felt the need to switch, but anyway, let's plug this bad boy in. Plugged in, I'm not gonna do a keyboard cam for this video. I don't feel like it's necessary, to be honest, because I mean, you guys already know what the keyboard looks like. I am gonna give you guys my honest opinion on what I think about this keyboard, and uh, yeah, we'll just see. Oh my God, why are there so many new game modes added to Fortnite. All right, we're gonna do some solos, boys. It's been a while since we've done solos on the channel, guys. It's been so long. You guys have been seeing me do random duos pretty much every day, and I really love doing that because I just love talking to random people, having a good conversation, and just seeing where the night takes us. So uh, uh, without further ado, we are going to hop into a solo match and see if we can actually perform pretty good with this keyboard. I honestly, I do like how it feels in a non-weird way. It actually feels pretty good on my hands. Uh, yeah. All right, here we go, boys. It's gonna be our first attempt using this new keyboard. For some reason, the space bar does not work. Uh, okay. Well, there it is, guys. So that's our first fault of the keyboard, okay? The space bar just didn't work. I had to press it like five times to jump out of the battle bus, which might be a big problem if we're in the middle of a gunfight, but all right, whatever. Here we go, boys. We're gonna land salty. I don't even know if I'm gonna make it there. I mean, so far, I really like the WASD. I feel like the movement's gonna be pretty nice. I just... I really hope to God this keyboard doesn't screw me over. Look at this guy. He just bumped into me. You know what? We're gonna have to kill him for that. I feel like some of the buttons on this keyboard don't even work properly. And that's probably gonna get me killed a lot. I can't I can't stand up. Bro. Bro, dude, this keyboard's gonna get me killed. I don't know if I can get used to this. Every time I get a new keyboard, it's always really hard to get used to, but no big deal. Oh my god, gold scar? Let's go, baby. Dude, the buttons are like delayed. Okay? Every time I press something, I have to press it like twice or three times. Oh no, dude. Open that door, big guy. Dude. Okay, thank you. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. I'm like playing like a trash can right now because I just, I'm not used to these keys, but you know what? We'll get used to it. Look at this. I'm literally spamming the space bar and sometimes it doesn't even jump, dude. But yeah, guys, let me know what you want to see next. I was also thinking about doing like a $1 mouse versus a $100 mouse and I just wanted to see how that would do. So if I actually end up dying this game, I'm just going to go back to my old keyboard and like give you guys a full on comparison of like what the difference is. And honestly, I do feel like it would be worth the investment to get a good keyboard if you want to play Fortnite because a lot of Fortnite requires a lot of buttons like building and switching your weapons and stuff. So you definitely want to have like a reliable keyboard to do that with, especially like a mechanical keyboard 
keyboard where you can kind of just have like a really good feel for like where the buttons are and like when they switch really fast and you know because the hardest thing about the one dollar keyboards is when you press down a button sometimes you really got to push it down hard in order for it to register into your game but if you get like a really fancy gaming keyboard a lot of them have like mechanical or like laser even like recognition and they'll easily switch between weapons and building stuff so i think it's worth it in my opinion let me know what kind of keyboard you guys have though i'm pretty curious to see what you all are working with here okay guys you know what i just figured out i don't even think it's the keyboard that's not letting me jump for some reason when i sprint i'm literally holding down shift i can't jump when i'm sprinting what why why is this a thing okay this is so weird because i'm literally using okay i I have both my keyboards plugged in and I just switched to my like actual keyboard that I use, the $100 one, and I'm sprinting and jumping at the same time. But with the cheap keyboard, I can't do that. That is, okay, that is weird. That is actually really weird. Hey guys, Alia here, bringing you all a brand new Fortnite Battle Royale video for you guys today. There's a bunch of bots in a fight over here. It's time to pull up. Dude, how do I only have one kill with 17 people left? This makes absolutely no sense. Hello there, bot. And goodbye, bot. Yep. Frank, you had no idea what's coming to you, bro. But you know what? It's all good. Okay. Actually, the $1 keyboard, it's pretty garbage. I did not recommend using this. Where are my friends? I'm looking for you. <laughs> Guys, I'm such a freak of nature sometimes. Dude, this stupid keyboard won't let me run and jump at the same time. Probably gonna die to some psycho bot. Dude, there is actually such a huge delay. I feel like if you actually have a good keyboard... There's no delay. Like my other keyboard, there's literally no delay when I press buttons. But here, I feel like there's like a 0.5 second delay every time I press down a key. Like I would press jump and it would happen half a second later. It's kind of weird. So you know what? Definitely never get a dollar keyboard because it is trash. Get a gaming keyboard. Or just don't use a keyboard and use two mouses instead. Ow. Yep. And then the there it is. Bro, this keyboard is actually so bad. Let's go, baby! Let's go! Dude, the dollar keyboard. Let's get it, bro. Dude, that's what I'm talking about, dude. That was the worst gunfight I've ever had in my entire life. If I had my normal keyboard, that guy would have been... Yup. Gimme, 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 gimme. We are definitely gonna die here. Come on, buddy. No way! No! Bro. Bro, somebody explain that to me. Please. Uh, yup. There it is, guys. That's the end of this keyboard. You know, I lived a good life. One game. Such a shame, really. Yup. There it is. This is why I don't do solos anymore, guys. Because for some reason, this new meta with the pump SMG and all that trash is so annoying. I hate it, dude. The shotguns are so bad. I am the biggest crybaby ever, bro. But you know what? I don't even care, dude. All right. Now we're going to show you guys what it's actually like to use a good keyboard. Never get a cheap keyboard, okay? Even if you just, like, got a PC and you're looking for a keyboard, it's worth it. Trust me. Get a good keyboard. You don't want to use a trash keyboard. Ah. <sighs> All right, well, now that my emotions are out, I think we might as well try to get a nice little win. All right, now, here's one of two things that is probably gonna happen in this game. I'm either gonna die off spawn, and I'm gonna break my $100 keyboard, or I'm gonna win this game. Oh, dude, this keyboard just feels so much better, dude. Like, the movement is just so smooth. Also, the spacing in between buttons is way better on, like, a nicer keyboard than it is on that $1 cheap garbage Amazon Prime trash. All right, there's another chest here. I'm gonna take my chances right now. I'm gonna pop this big shield, and if there's minis in there, I'm just gonna end the video, all right? All right, here we go. Ah, look at that. Watch this. What? Wait, what? Get beasted. He had no idea. He had no idea what was about to happen to him. Ah, hello there, little junior. Dude, I really hate the spraying. Dude, how many times do I have to shoot you with a shotgun to kill you, bro? This is annoying. Dude, can you die? Can you please die? Thank you. <laughs> Dude, that took... That was ridiculous, man. Hello there. 13 damage. Bro. Yep, I, I don't even have anything to say about that, really. I, I just give up at this point. 
Goodbye. Jeez! Why? Dude, it is actually the lamest thing ever. I hate season five of Fortnite. This video is over, all right? Brought to you by Horrible Keyboards. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you guys want to see more just weird keyboard and stuff. I hate doing solos, guys. I, I, dude, please, please, all right? Thank you guys so much for watching. It has been your boy, Alex. Also known as Formula. I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Dasi Daniel.